Oh, yeah, I think you did right. This is a big accomplishment, actually. Yeah, how's it feel? You know, to get gold plate here? Uh, it's honestly an honor. You know, it's for like the first generation of the uh, gold plate. It's like the honor just to be able to get in where, um, just be able to earn it. I feel like uh, I've done like a great job just putting out all my effort uh, and earning it. So I feel like uh, this might be honor. Who presented it to you? You saw your former high school coach out here? Matt Liner, actually. So that was super dope. Like, just because he's a monarch. So being able to like have him hand it to me as a uh, USC ex Trojan, ex monarch, that was like super dope. So that, that's, that was super big for me. Do you know who planned that for you? He said planned it? Um, no, I don't think anybody. I, I don't know who planned it. It might have been Coach Lincoln. I don't know. But he didn't say nothing. Else, so we'll see. Is it a thing where you kind of feel like it's coming, or is it kind of you know even thinking about that, or were you surprised out there? Uh, once they announced it, I was the, that's what the main thing I was working towards uh, this all spring ball, just trying to like show showcase my talents and you know just get 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 what I needed to get to uh, just to show the coaches what I am. What did you take from that first year of college ball last year? Um, just lessons. It was mostly lessons. That's really what I took from it. Um, just being able to sit there and just watch everything like fall in place. That was like a big thing for me last year. Um, not really overreact about anything. Just you know, take take all the punches, roll with them, and then just you know, land where I land. What's the process of maturing been like for you this offseason? Um, I feel like it's been like a good process. Uh, not too much. Like not not too much. Um, bad things going on. I've been trying to like stay on top of everything because Coach Odom's like a super good uh, coach so he stays on us about uh, accountability so that's really the rest of the maturity of being just being accountable. What was your first impression of Coach Odom when you kind of met him? Um, I didn't really like know too much about him so it was just like a little, a little odd at first and then once I kind of got to meet him more and more and then met his family uh, it was like like just having another dad so it was just it was super, super cool dude. What was the most frustrating part of last year? Uh, probably the losing part. Like I've just, I've never been like a, a, a on the losing side of anything, so that was just like a huge shock for me. But um, that was the main thing, um, just being able to be out there and like see it was good for me. But the losing part, I just hated it. So we got to change that automatically. How do you feel like this defense? How do you feel like this defense utilizes your strengths? We're able to run around fast, make plays. Uh, I feel like that utilizes me a lot. Uh, listen, um, just being able to play in space, that's like a super big thing for me. So I feel like that's gonna help me uh, showcase my talent. What was the biggest thing you think that kind of kept you off the field last year that you did? You had to get a long point in the show. Uh, really, it was my um, playbook and my weight. So I just had to, you know, figure all that stuff out. Got my weight up, and changed everything. Um, just got, I, I fit, I mentally got better. So that's what helped me. I feel like uh, get better through this off season and get me on the field this year. Can you try in any like, different methods of learning the playbook this season? Uh, just spending more time with my coach. Um, just you know, learning what he wants me to know, so I can be able to. Um, like speak it what he how he wants to translate it so uh that really that's really what i've been working on just being with him more being in his office you know just spending more time with him you feel like you learned a little bit about like how much time is needed to succeed at this level during your freshman year yes um just from the older players um we had a lot of like dedicated players last year that were like always in the building um it wasn't like everybody but it was a lot of like uh dedicated players so they just taught me you got to be able to show yourself like show, show that you're around show that you care and then like, uh, it'll all come to you once you just show you're there. What's the process of adding weight like? Um, at first, uh, it was kind of hard, just like trying to uh, get away from my family and then like adjust to everything, being by myself. But ever since like the spring ball started, it's been going up and up, so it's, like, it's been really good now. What do you want to play at? Uh, coach wants me at 220. I'm at 220 right now, so but I'm trying to get 225. How much of a gain is that for you since last year? Uh, last year I was at like 207, so it was like 13 pounds, pretty good. Mm -hmm. Really everything, they told me, like they've been telling me to eat every three hours. That's been the main thing, eat every three hours. Uh, you know, before I go to sleep, eat two peanut butter and jelly sandwiches, uh, take a shake, drink a shake, drink, go to bed, wake up, drink uh, Powerade. Just, you know, just keep my body um, hydrated and just keep my, my body fueled. What sort of impact has Shane Lee had on you? 
Uh, that dude, bro. Ever since he came in, it's just been like that's really when I got my weight up. Like, uh, just seeing him being able to like have a role model like that, uh, super. Because he was, I remember him in high school. He's like an all all star. So just have him in there, uh, just you know, it, it, I would say it brought me up. Uh, made me want to work harder. So I feel like ever since he got here, it's been awesome. We've heard a lot about him as a leader. Mm -hmm. What's a good example of how he demonstrates leadership? Um, I'll say the weight room. When we got in the weight room uh, on Big Spot Friday five plates on his back. I was like, I gotta get my game up now. Uh, so I was like, you know, let me throw on four plates to just get it right. So ever since then, like, ever since he just stepped on the campus, it's been a huge change for me. Uh, like, it's just all about effort now, that's all it is. You know, you don't like to reflect back too much on last season, but how big of a difference is it this year compared to last year? Uh, I'll say it's a huge difference. Like the way our players react to certain things, uh, we like. I would say we're more closer than we were last year. There's a lot of like down talking on other people. Um, I would say it's a lot better this year. Um, just you know, we're all closer and we like we just hang out more. I would say we're more uh, close knit. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.